Hello there people of the internet, Crawling UK here with Nintendo Switch game version of Batman the Telltale series. Uh, this is probably going to play very much similar, if you've seen previously, uh, Minecraft on the Nintendo Switch, or if you've seen any Telltale games on any platform. They're basically just story driven games. You play a character, you maybe find a couple of uh, items here and there. Uh, we're going to have a quick look at this settings here. Yeah, so you find a couple of items here and there, you speak to people, you choose particular dialogue which will change the course of the story, which may change the end narrative, if you like. I'm just going to change this, um, ch I'm going to just lower this music. Subtitles on in case I miss anything. Subtitles small is fine for myself. Go back to the previous menu. Gameplay options. Invert Y on. Display style. Minimal standard. I'll just leave it as standard. And we go back. We want to apply that. And episodes will get us started. Let's have a look. Obviously, episode one. It's just the slider, so the bat symbol is barely visible. I don't know what, how this is going to come out in the video, but ah, there we go. It's just barely visible now for me. Select a bat tech color. Why would I do this? Okay, sensor of purple it is. And there's silence. <laughs> it loads. It takes its time, but it's loading. I have noticed that recently a lot of uh, Nintendo Switch games are taking a bit longer to load. I think they're trying to push the uh, bigger titles that are on maybe PS4 or Xbox to be released on the Nintendo Switch. And these are probably taking just a bit longer than normal games would on the Nintendo Switch and when I say a normal game, a game that Nintendo develops like Mario or Zelda. This game series adapts to the choices you make. Let's open start. Oh, here we go. So there's a lot of story in this so there's going to be probably less of me talking soon. Yeah, this game is uh, 18 plus just for your information. Hey. <laughs> huh? 
X. Yep. <laughs> Now what? Bruce, you can't keep doing this. I have to. <laughs> no one else will. Every drop of blood, everything you've sacrificed. The city is safer now. It's made you a target. And people will keep you in the crosshairs until you're shot uh, out of the sky. There we go. The decision making was a lot faster this time. I think as games have gone on, the uh, decisions that you make in these Telltale games are uh, becoming a lot faster. Originally, you had quite a long time, but it seemed like the other person was waiting for your response for a long time, so it probably seemed silly. Hence why it's a lot faster now. Zeta didn't give me enough time to think almost then. <laughs> back to back, circle up. What's he got? As you can probably see, it's just all quick time button events. Do it fast enough and you I succeed. To create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come on! Come on! Come on! <laughs> I didn't do that fast enough. X. Uh, did I do that right? Ah, um, those two. <laughs> ah, up, 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 up. Teach you to knock. Behind you, big boy. Huh? Payday. I was pressing B, but it didn't light up orange. Succeeding. Criminals are becoming afraid of you. So are the police. It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. It's actually a very good intro. Got lots of uh, 
input to do there. Normally you don't have so much uh, action. So far. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why you do all this. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. No one else will. I'm the only one who gets the job done. Sounds lonely. Gotta admit it, though. You give a good chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. And let's put you in a cage. Bring it, Bat. <laughs> Down B, down B. That didn't look like it was uh, avoidable. Oh, but I got her. Well, I think. Why go to all that trouble for this? Shit! A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. God damn it! I said, don't shoot me. No, wait. Wow. <sighs> that was quite intense. It was enjoyable, but intense. Uh, guess I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. Don't struggle or you'll fall. No, but that's what you crave. The struggle. I know men like you. Hmm. 
Step out of the shadows. And be Bruce Wayne tonight. Well, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then. Time to save the city. Well, I think that was uh, a good intro for a Telltale's game. A Telltale game. And I think I'm going to end my video here because I don't want to really spoil it for anyone. If you've seen this intro and you like it, then go ahead, buy it, and you'll enjoy the rest of the game. It's five chapters like most Telltale games. So if you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Like in Batman, also give me a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you already haven't. These always helps me out. But as always, thank you very much for watching. Bye. I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city.